Yo, what it is, everybody. Thanks for tuning in for another episode here on the Speedbug channel. I wanted to talk to you guys about helmets today because I actually get quite a bit of requests on helmets, and you guys seem to really like it when I do helmet videos. Now, this is kind of a apples to oranges comparison, but also wanted to show you guys a complete difference between the helmets and why you necessarily shouldn't use your motorcycle helmet when you're racing your car, as opposed to your car helmet also racing on your motorcycle. So I have two right here pretty much top of the line helmets. One is an AGV Pista, carbon Pista, and this is a Simpson Ghost Bandit carbon helmet. And as you can just see in the complete differences in the shape of the helmets, and of course how they just look completely different, and how one, you know, obviously tunnels wind and stuff like that. Well, this one really doesn't have to because it's pretty much enclosed inside of a capsule or your vehicle whether it be in a dragster or a fully enclosed car now the inside is really where it shines completely different as you can see you have ear pockets and places maybe to put speakers or intercom uh, the pista has places for your water uh, where the bandits and the simpsons simpsons pretty much the top of the line for automotive where it you know it's just pr pretty much provisioned for your head and your fire suit sock now putting both of them on and as you can even see where the neckline is completely different uh it's they feel entirely different and you have to try them on for your head because the way a motorcycle helmet is going to fit on you as opposed to a car helmet just not going to be the same so definitely make sure you you know order one try it out if it doesn't work you send it back and get you the right size um do i think you can use your motorcycle helmet uh, for your car, uh, for your car racing maybe in the beginning if you know have a 12 or 11 or 10 second car but ultimately you're gonna need it doesn't have to be a carbon helmet I just chose that but if you're going to be racing your car make sure you get a quality car helmet you'll be able to see you have much uh, different type of visibility and the angle of the helmet is just completely different as you're kind of tucked down going fast and you kind of have your head straight up uh, pretty much on a automotive helmet as opposed to a motorcycle helmet Is one better than the other well the answer to that is Really the job of the helmet is to protect your skull in case you get into a collision Whether your head hits the roll cage the side of the car the window it flips whatever whoever knows uh, in the event of an accident hopefully you don't get into an accident, but that's what it's there for if you're going to get into an accident make sure you get a helmet that is not too loose but also not too tight where it's completely uncomfortable would i buy either one of these helmets again in non-carbon absolutely yes i would and i pretty much have that one right here for a motorcycle one it is a k1 and i love it i primarily use this to ride on the street and i use this when i'm going to race at the drag strip or i'm on a road course it is a much tighter fit and this I primarily always use, uh, it, even though it is new, but I had a different auto helmet. Uh, but I use this for the racetrack in my Corvette. So I uh, wanted to show both of you guys this. And is the carbon worth the extra money? You kind of have to decide that for yourself. Is it lighter? A couple ounces. Is it much lighter than the plastic to make it worth the money? No. Uh, I'm going to tell you that right now. Uh, it's really just for your aesthetics and for your looks if you like carbon and you can afford it I say go for it if that shit don't mean nothing to you Then get the helmet that's gonna protect your head and feel the best and make you feel the most secure But most importantly also that you have great visibility and uh, That's my take on the two top helmets that I feel that are pretty good uh, Bell makes a good carbon helmet and a few other ones, but I'm not going to just list the names. Bell is pretty badass, but uh, I do like theirs, and I have one of theirs as well. But uh, thanks for tuning in for another episode here on the Speedbug channel, and we will see you sooner than later. Peace out, y'all.